Hey Aries, welcome back. Welcome back, honey. Welcome back to my channel. Um, this reading is all about you guys today. Um, I know I've been MIA for a couple of hours, <laughs> maybe two, two days, okay? But anywho, this is going to be your lucky day, right? So as usual, you know the YouTube stuff. Go ahead, hit that subscribe for the ones that are new here. Um, and for all my returning seekers i love you guys you guys are amazing just know that this reading will not resonate for every single one of you take the real what resonate and leave the rest in the trash okay all right i'm going to get into a quick prayer y'all because for those of you that for those of you that don't know your girl do pray here right because prayer is a must i'm just going to tap into your energy after that prayer is done and just kind of see some messages that comes through all right so let's just go ahead and say that quick prayer and let's take it from there all right. Heavenly Father, as I go along my day, I ask that you bless myself and my seekers, Heavenly Father, please send the most powerful angels to take charge over this reading into my body as a vessel, giving me the right words and giving me the right messages that you want me to share the ones that needs to know. Heavenly Father, I do give you all the honor and all the praise. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. All right, y'all. Oh, happy hmm, Monday. Yeah, happy Monday, y'all. It's just about my bedtime. I am in my nighty, my nightgown, but I figured let me come here and just show you guys some extra amount of love, okay? All right, angels, let's tap into the energy. And again, guys, if you do need to have a personal reading with me, you can always connect with me using the information that you'll find in the description part of today's video. And just know because this reading is a general one, and I will say again, a general one and not a personal. It could go in the reverse, all right? Um, just take what, take what's yours, okay? The roles can be reversed here, as always. Um, your person's energy past, but not future person, your person who first came to your thought. That is your person, okay? Now, also, just connect for a personal reading, and that information will be in the description part of this video. All right, see what's coming through for you guys. All right. So there's a choice that needs to be made here, but I'm feeling this choice is calling for a new direction. You might have thought this thing through, is what angels are saying here, but I feel like you definitely had made a wrong choice. Now it's time to go in the opposite way, all right? Um, find a new way to resolve this situation here because the way that you're on, the path that you're on is not the right one here. It's just plain as that. That's what I'm seeing here for some of you. I'm seeing that you need to talk to the angels. Ask the angels for help. Stop going to people and relating your business and your problems, okay? Because it's only making things for us, y'all, okay? Stop sharing your, your energy with people that's not needed to be in your energy and in your space because I see destruction here, okay? Not everyone that prays for you means well for you is what I need to share with you guys. A piece of resolution is what you're looking for. I feel like you've definitely been in between pop between a rock and a hard place here. I feel like there may be a lot of conflicts that's going on for some of you with your situation. Um, the situation will improve once you stop telling your business to people. And that's just as plain as it is, okay? Stop relating your situation here. Perfect time, it will find its way, okay? And stop going to people that is just making the situation worse is what I'm seeing here. I'm getting promises were made that's been broken. But I'm getting that you will recover from these promises is what you need to know. Um, this uh, recovery is going to bring some massive amount of happy changes. Big happy changes that's coming in. For some of you, you need this happy change, all right? Because you've just been telling your business to all these negative people. That's what I'm feeling here. And it's just making things uh, blow out of proportion here. Some of these people doesn't give a self of direction. They don't know where they're going. Stop telling your business, Aries. What's going on with all of that? All right, let's go ahead and just tap into your energy, my loves. Take a nice deep breath, my darlings, and let's tap all up in that energy. See what's coming through. I'm going to post some messages here, and then I'm going to use the tarot deck to clarify some things. Some things going all up in your business, y'all. <laughs> all right, all right, angels, let me have some messages here, please. What's the present energy? Okay, look at this. Someone is really wanting to come through your reading here, my darlings. What I'm seeing here is, someone is saying here, I, use, I, they, I used you for my own selfish convenience here. You see what I'm telling you? Stop telling people your business, because these people is nothing but trash, y'all. 
Somebody saying that they use you for their own selfish convenience is is. <laughs> Are we surprised based on what I've already told you, y'all? I know I'm not. Okay. Stop sharing the personal, y'all. I'm telling you, stop sharing the personal because I'm getting. Somebody saying that her soul is connected. Our soul connection can never be broken. What is this that I'm seeing here? But I'm feeling like somebody's really selfish here. Selfish, manipulative, mind game, egoistic energy here. And someone that's really taking your kindness for some kind of convenience here. Wow. Let's see. Mm -mm -mm. Hmm. Okay. So now I feel this, this, this whoever person, okay, Aries? Because we're going to get to the bottom of things here. Now, this person who's talking about they taking your taking you for some kind of convenience. I'm getting karma, honey, is what I'm getting here, okay? Everything in my life is saying that they're saying that everything is falling apart. Look at that. Everything seems to be falling apart for them, all right? And we know why that, right? Because somebody's trying to take your kindness for weakness here. Okay? They're trying to take your kindness for weakness. I do feel like you do like this person a lot, a whole lot, okay? But because this person know that you like them a lot, they're playing mind over matter here. Let's have a complete do-over, okay? It doesn't hurt to start fresh. All right, so this person seems to want to come back. Even though they're trying to have this relationship feels like a selfish one. One that just fills with nothing but convenience here. I'm getting this person wants to come back. They want to have a complete do-over type of a situation with you, all right? They're saying, I can't stop thinking of you no matter how hard I try. Right? I can't stop thinking of you how much hard, no matter how hard I try. You are my twin flame is what they're saying. I feel like you know this person from for some time, okay? Is what I'm feeling. But someone is saying that they're afraid here. I'm afraid to tell you the truth, okay? So I feel like this person is keeping a secret, a hidden a secret here. And I feel like this person have an agenda, okay? And this agenda is giving me, I'm having mental issues, okay? Someone is having mental health issues behind or break up here. This could be you. Who knows, okay? Because the roles could be damn well reversed here is what I'm feeling. But someone is having a mental breakdown here because of what's not going one's way here. Because someone is allowing someone to kind of play them for a fiddle here. And I'm getting, listen, you're not about to be played around with, okay? Because you're the complete package is what I'm seeing here, okay? You're the complete package, all right? All right, let's go ahead and just kind of clarify these cards here. Because something needs to be clarified here is what I'm seeing from my end, Aries. From my end. Let's see what's popping here. All right, angels, let's clarify these cards, please. Let's get some clarification here. All right. All right, tell me more, angels. Tell me more, please. Tell me more, please. Tell me more. Please tell me more. Okay. Okay. So I feel like your strength has either been tested here. Okay. Um, your strength has definitely been tested. Okay. Somebody's really tapping all up into your strength. Okay. Playing mind game here. But also, I do feel like your strength is needed to kind of backfire here. So that these roles can be reversed on your behalf here. Because see, what's really happening here, here is you've already given all that you can here. Okay? And even though I feel like for some of you, you really want to make things work here, I do see you moving forward. Moving forward and trying to get away from all of this nonsense here. I'm getting promises. I'm getting broken promises here. Okay? I see the Six of Swords here. I see you getting ready to hop, skip, and jump, okay? You don't want to deal with this anymore. You're just trying to get your strength together here and just kind of build up your momentum and just kind of walk away because I feel like you're just sick and tired of being sick and tired, okay? You're sick and tired to be sick and tired wondering if this person is your twin flame or your twin hate. Who the hell knows, okay? That's what I'm seeing here. You just don't want to be burdened anymore. You, I see you've been burdened here. You know, for some of you, maybe dealing with a Leo here. Okay. 
Tap it all up in the energy, okay? That's what I'm seeing. Tell me more angels because somebody's about to run to the west. Okay. Let's see here. Okay. Okay. So what I do see is a situation here where this promise that we talked about, Aries, I see this promise coming in. But the thing with this promise here, this promise is not coming in as as as, as how you might have expect it. I see this person coming in towards you, but this person is coming in towards you hella, hella slow here, right? So let's just say if you're waiting for an apology or if you're waiting for this person to give you an I love you Lucy type of a thing, you're going to have to wait a little bit longer, okay? And I feel like this person doesn't even know the direction that they're going, even with themselves. They don't even know how that you're going at this damn slow ass pace here, right? But I do feel also with this chariot being here, I see like you're about to make some moves for yourself here. But I also feel, Aries, that some of you are going rather slow as well. Making this choice, making this decision, knowing what's good for you. Stop having these people all up in your energy, okay? This is why your strength card is here to have you know that your strength is needed here. Because, honey, baby, if you do not tap into your strength, I'm getting this manipulative, um, narcissistic type of a person will definitely play you for a fool, okay? Because they're over here trying to confuse me as is, okay? But it's not going to happen because I'm going to spill the beans, all right? The beans are about to be spilled, honey. Angels, tell me more, please. Because somebody's about to be exposed over here. What's this? All right. So let's just say this to say that, okay, Aries? Now it's time that you really start planting them seeds, okay? Like, really, really planting some seeds here because you ain't about to be broke, okay? You don't want to be broke. For some of you, money ain't going right at this particular moment. And I'm just feeling that this chariot person here is just having you feeling broke, all right? Um, I feel like you should not wait for these promises anymore because you're going to be broker, all right? And we're not trying to be broker. We're trying to achieve... And manifest greatness here, okay? And have this back in the upright, okay? You've already given a situation already what you can give here, right? Um, you already waited things out. And now I see where you're exhausted from waiting, okay? Waiting and waiting and waiting for change here. Someone is having you wait and wait and wait until the cows come home, all right? And I don't know when them damn cows are coming home. Okay, I ain't waiting for that. Okay. Somebody put an end to this dream here. Is the thing the thing the thing is, Aries, <clears throat> you guys had a, a groove a little thing. You y'all got going a groove a little thing at one point, but somebody decided to put an end to the groove a little situation, okay? Somebody ended whatever it could have been here because they were a fool for having this going upside down here see i feel like this person now they know that they kind of realize that you are the best thing that ever happened to them and they will never meet anyone like you ever again okay because see the thing what i'm seeing here is that you have put up with a lot of things here with this a person with the situation so they will never meet anyone like you ever again okay because they chose to put an end to the dream with you guys here well, let's see what's happening here, okay? Because there's something that you need to know here, okay? That's on period, Aries. There's something that you need to know because, wow. Okay? Now, what I do see is manipulation that's coming in here, okay? This person is very manipulative and very tricky at their game here. Very tricky, okay? Um, they say one thing, but they do something else. Okay, as far as your financial situation is, this person is not willing to go the mile with you as far as money is concerned, as far as making dreams here. But what I do see is an opportunity that is coming towards you here. I'm seeing um, you're going to be happy, all right? I'm getting love is going to find its way to you. That is true love. Do not force it though, okay? Just wait patiently and be of good courage is what I need to share with you guys. But it is going to happen, okay? Um, I'm also feeling as if um, you might have trusted this person with something. Maybe you have might have loaned this person money, okay? Um, and I feel that they still I gave you an IOU, okay? They need to give you back all what they gave. What I see here is that you're holding on to things here. 
And I do feel not only are you holding on to things that came with this relationship, um, I see you taking on the burden here. You took on a lot of the responsibility. I do feel for some of you, you might have taken on most of the responsibility as far as financial circumstances was. Not only did you take on the relationship of what the relationship was meant to bring in for two people, but I do see you taking on 90% of the responsibility here. Now, the problem with this is that this dead card is in the reverse, okay? Um, I feel like you're done. You're done with it. You're done wasting time with a loser here, okay? You're done with it um, because this new beginning that's supposed to happen or something that needed to end here, that didn't work out as planned. So now you're about to just kick rocks and keep and have two skips here because you're done holding on to this relationship. You're done wasting time. You're done sitting on the top of the deck just looking down doing nothing. You're not doing that anymore because just remember that this chariot here, this person is moving rather slowly. Like a snail. Like a snail. The tower is here, y'all. Things seem to be falling apart here. The more that you hold on to this ten of wands, you're getting the tower here. Everything is falling apart here. This person stays juggling a lot of things here. This could be they're juggling your heart. They're juggling money and they, it, the, the delusional. You know what I'm saying? Um, this could be you as well. Just take it as, as it resonates, y'all, because it is a general reading. Mm -hmm. So this person could be like hella delusional, okay? Don't know where they're going. Don't know if they want to be with you one minute. They don't know if they want to be over here. Who the hell knows, okay? But I see somebody juggling something here, trying to figure some things out over here. All right, um, this nine of one, I do feel this 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 nine of ones, I do also feel as if there's a situation that is very complicated here. I'm getting fair. I'm getting um at a standstill here. For one minute, you don't know if this person is fighting with you or fighting against you. All right, um, hopeless case, and this is why the lovers card is here. The lovers card is having me feel like. Something is very toxic here, okay? Very toxic situation here. Um, I do feel like um, it's like Adam and Eve. You know what I'm saying? It's like Adam and Eve, y'all. Okay? Somebody ate the damn badass apple and shared that shit, okay? And now somebody's going to have to take control and try to fix things back into reality here. But there's going to be consequences here, okay? Based on one's choice um, that one needs to take here. But at the end of the day, there's a decision that needs to be made. Is what I'm seeing here, Aries. It's a massive decision that is needed here because someone is about ready to start a hollering, okay? And I, I, I'm getting, don't be the one that's the hollering. Be the one that's going to rejoice in because somebody done messed up a good thing here. And I feel like for some of you need to know that you have to move forward. The decision has to be made here because if the decision is not made, I'm getting a loss here, a loss of one's mental frame of mind to think clearly okay because someone is definitely one minute i want this the next minute i don't want that and it's having you in a very dark place here so now it's time that you get things together here put milestones into milestones do not wait and i repeat do not wait any longer on this situation to change you have to change the situation before it kicks your ass okay now this is going to be your reading honey for today I hope it did resonate with some of you, however, if it didn't, I do have a playlist, so you want to go ahead and check on that playlist and see if you can find something that resonates to what you're dealing with right now, um, and again, y'all, thank you for all the love and support that you show on my sister's um, channel, if you want to go ahead and subscribe to her channel on our cancer journey, I will leave her link down in the description box for you guys to go over and, and, and just show her some good love, okay? Um, and also, remember to pray, and if you do need um, a prayer request, go ahead and just put your initials in the comment section as well. Pray for me, y'all, as I'll be praying for you. And with that said, I love you guys so, so much, and I'll see you in my next one. Always remember to seek first, and you'll always find. Bye!